about half of people with psychiatric disorders will at some point in their lifetime experience a substance use disorder as well. Historically, mental health and substance use problems were dealt with by quite different systems of care uh, with poor coordination between the two. So if a person had both mental health and substance use issues, they might find themselves having a hard time finding care to begin with, certainly finding care that meets their needs, and they also might be bounced from one service to another. One basic problem to these services being quite separate is that people had to repeat their stories multiple times to multiple providers. Uh, they might have to deal with one problem before being eligible to deal with another problem under the other system. Um, and it puts the onus of care on the person themselves when they're already going through a difficult time. It doesn't mean that we take a cookie cutter approach to how we provide care to people that have both mental health and substance use problems. What it means is that we're able to provide a holistic person-centered approach to meet the range of an individual client's needs. The research says that for people with concurrent mental health and substance use issues, that an integrated approach to treatment actually provides earlier detection and intervention and better outcomes. In light of the fact that there are so many people that experience both mental health and substance use issues, most if not all jurisdictions in the country have either moved towards uh, or are moving towards integrated structures and services for mental health and substance use.